having a fire walk, we've got to find the EQ, the emotional quotient, always, rather than give facts and figures. Prospects don't care about your features and benefits. They don't care about them. What they do care is about their needs being fulfilled. True or false? True. Absolutely. Um, somebody, here's a good one. Um, who, who wants to sell, a pen, sell me a pen? Who wants to sell me a pen? Who's, where's my volunteer here? Donald, go for it. Sell me this pen. Donald, I am a, Donald, I am a Chihuahua salesman, okay? And, I, and, and you sell pens. Claude, uh, what, what, do you, what is it you do all day for? I, for I, sell, I sell Chihuahuas. I am the number one San Diego Chihuahua salesman, man. They're always, people just love my little yappers. <laughs> so, so when you go out, you're doing a lot of contracts. You're getting people to sign contracts and things with you. Isn't that right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So just imagine one day that you're out and you got a good sales going along. Somebody wants 10 pups and you don't have a pen. Can you imagine that happen? And you got the good, a good sale for you right now and you missed the opportunity because you didn't have a, a great pen or you had a pen that stopped writing at that particular time? You know, it's funny you said that. That's happened to me. A couple, I lost a sale. A guy wanted five chihuahuas in his one bedroom apartment and, and, um, and I didn't have a pen and I told him I'd, I'd email him something later in the day and uh, later on when I contacted him, he bought chihuahuas from somebody else. Just so how did you feel? I didn't have a pen when I was right in front of them that one time. How, how did you feel about that? I, I felt I, I, I lost money. I wow. felt horrible. Wow. I, I could see that happening to, to you. And, and it happened to some, a friend of mine that also does sales. And he didn't have a pen. And uh, he actually lost uh, that sale. And he lost his, uh, him being able to, to pay his bills. So, so Clyde. I, I feel that you need something, uh, a good quality pen that will actually keep you uh, in a loop of writing up contracts. So what, what if I can produce a pen that can actually be attached to you that would actually help you in the future? Give me, give me more. Give me, give me, give me three to, give me three to six emotional needs and greeds based on you're doing great. Now take everything you did, summarize it, and put it in a and put it in a final question with at least three to six of the needs and greeds that you received that you just got on the pen. Go ahead, close me. So, so Claude, if I can provide you with a pen that you can keep up with that would actually write for you, how would you feel about that? Give me would more. That some, would that be something you'll be looking for? Uh, you think that it helped you in your sales if you had a quality pen with you at all times? Okay, what, uh, off the role play. What I want you to do though is, um, uh, Donald, imagine for a moment, you're never in that position where you're embarrassed, you're feeling, you know, where you're feeling uncertain, where you're losing money just because you don't have a pen with you and we could solve that problem. How would you feel if, if we could solve that right now? It's okay to say no to me, but you don't want to be in that position where you're losing money, where you're embarrassed in front of a client, where your sales are going to your competition all the time. You work so hard. You want to make money right now. Suppose we could solve that right now by getting you this pen. How would you feel about that? And it's okay to say no. Well, okay. Yes, that would be outstanding. See, see what I'm doing? Mm-hmm. I'm embedding all that EQ there, insecurity. What are the emotional quotients we're going for? Fear, uh, greed, envy, all the different things we talk about. We, we talked about in other type of topics, uh, make, uh, being assertive, using scarcity, reciprocity, trust, likability, social proof. How about social proof? Hey, you know, Donald, you're in sales. Do you know, do you know what your, comp, you know, the pen, your comp, you have competition out there that are doing two to three times the business you're doing. Do you know, do you know what they're using? Do you know why? Why is that, Claude? It's, it's the pen, man. It's the pen. Suppose there was a way you had a pen that could help you to write more orders so you wouldn't miss orders. That wouldn't make a difference in your world, would it? In your income? Yes. You know, just like your comp, that's social proof. That's what other people are doing. That's, that's social proof Cialdini talks about.